New at 6, a very special opening day for the Pawtucket Red Sox. Two local Marines are being honored at McCoy Stadium tonight. Captain Kyle Van de Giesen and Private First Class Kyle Kutu were both killed in action in Afghanistan. In less than an hour, their loved ones will throw out the first pitches. The special honor will be just one of many opening day highlights for the 10,000 fans on hand for the game. Eyewitness News reporter Alex DiPrato is there now live at the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom. Alex? Well, Karen, those service members will be honored later on during the game. But first, it's opening day, and what a beautiful day it is. Fans and both the Paw Sox are ready. Opening day for the Paw Sox is picture perfect. With the weather like this, it doesn't get any better than this. The players are warming up, and the fans, both young and old, are ready. And what are you hoping for this year? A uh, winning season. I'd like to see them win. You want to see them win? Oh, yeah. They got a whole new team now. The Paw Sox take on the Rochester Red Wings in their season opener. Owner Ben Mondor says the team is ready. What are you expecting? I hope 10,000 people. And a win. Oh, the win's automatic. <laughs> <laughs> but not quite. The last time the Red Wings and the Paw Sox squared off on opening day, the score was 18-1. to 1. But Mondor says this team is different. How confident are you that this team can pull it off? It's a sure thing. Fans are just as enthusiastic. Now the Paw Sox just have to perform on the field. And as we said earlier, this ball game will take on a serious note as two fallen service members from this area are honored. We'll have their story tonight on Eyewitness News at 10 and 11. For now, we are live in Pawtucket with the Mobile Newsroom. I'm Alex DePrado, Eyewitness News.